Well, and all the things that you say, okay, it's my son, I will not see him graduating from the Air Force, I will never see him, you know, getting married. What we're looking for is that magic phone call for somebody to call in and say, hey, this is what I saw, this is whom I saw, and this is the information that I need to give you. Already at that party, um, to beat Eric Navarro over a $15 uh, debt. Once Eric Navarro arrived to the, that location, which is a, an apartment building, um, he was confronted over the $15 uh, debt. That led to the brutal beating and subsequently the death of Eric Navarro. After Navarro was brutally beat, Oscar Ocampo, along with Arturo Daza, took the body of Eric Navarro and dumped the body into a field behind the building of 58 East North Avenue in Northlake, Illinois. The body laid in that field for several days until Arturo Daza, along with Oscar Ocampo, returned in a vehicle, removed the body from that location, subsequently dumping it into a dumpster in an alley near the intersection of Madison and Keeler uh, in the west side of Chicago. The body was then uh, doused with uh, gasoline and set on fire, which caused the body to be uh, unrecognizable. <laughs>